we all come here with our unique thoughts and emotions, right? We don't leave them at home and come. It's, it's all right here. Our experience, our, our unique ourselves, <laughs> everything about us. And um, when I was introduced to open intelligence, it's where I was introduced to the magic of reality. Now, ordinary magic, <laughs> natural magic, a reality as it is. And um, I, I'm so grateful for that, to get to know myself and to allow myself to be as I am, to get to know all my thoughts and emotions, experiences as open intelligence. Open intelligence, like you heard, it's at the basis of everything. It's at the basis, it's, it's inseparable from everything that appears. It's like the color blue in the sky inseparable. That's how our thoughts and emotions, experiences, we call it data here, these are inseparable from open intelligence. So just to hear that, even if we can't really get that, just to hear that and rest in its potency, you've been introduced to open intelligence, the inseparability of all data as open intelligence, pure intelligence. Our intelligence is pure. Everything about us is pure. All of our negative emotions, negative sensations, also pure, pure intelligence, perfect love, perfect knowledge, perfect benefit. Now we might think, how can my uh, social awkwardness can be of benefit, or how can my hatred be of benefit, or jealousy, desire, all of the things that are really disturbing for us, or our family can be of benefit, or, you know, just, our intimate relationship, money, no money can be of benefit. So just take a, take a moment to just let it be as it is. <laughs> what about just let everything be as it is, open like the vast sky, open as you are, clear, alert. You know, like the introduction to open intelligence, stop thinking for a moment. Just pause all the, th the train of thoughts right now and look at what is at the basis, what remains when you stop thinking. For a moment, alertness, openness, clarity, clarity, sharp clarity, the ability to know, the power to know, the power to know the next thought, the next emotion. So that power to know rests in that. You don't need to move anywhere or moving your mind in such way. Resting naturally as you are. Resting at the basis of all experiences, at the ba basis of all appearances. And then just for the introduction, that's all. You stop thinking. Everything comes back. Thoughts, emotions, because we can't really maintain stop thinking, right? It's like we can't um, stop seeing each other or speaking or not having any thoughts. We might have it for some times, but this also a thought. I'm not thinking about anything, <laughs> right? It can't really happen. So let's not fool ourselves anymore. Let everything be as it is. And then the practice of short moments of open intelligence is very profound. You can take it with you today and you can take it for the rest of your life. Short moments of open intelligence repeated many times until it becomes spontaneous, continuous. So short moments of completely relaxing body and mind. Complete relaxation. Short moments of resting naturally as you are. A short moment, it's short. Yeah, it's short, just like short moment, but however long it's for you or short it's for you. Even just to hear short moment, you take it. It's uncontrived short moments of open intelligence. Yeah, and then short moment of complete relaxation, allowing your thoughts flowing on by, like a line drawn in water. You know where you come to the water and with your finger just throw a line? It, it leaves no trace. That's, that's the trace of our thoughts and emotions. They leave nothing. Like the next thought, the next thought, the next experience, the next sensation. You see, it's a flow. It's a flow, it's a powerful flow, but we let that be as it is. It can, it can feel like lots of sensations, lots of emotions, overwhelming. It can feel like it's, it's, it's always there. 
or it's come, it comes back to me over and over again, or I'm getting crazy, I'm out of control. I'm so jealous, I'm so angry. Please help me, or please get me out of here. Or everything that can be. Just allow that flow to be as it is. And maintain open intelligence. That's the practice, short moments. A short moment. I'm repeating that because it's, it's just powerful, you know, when I've been introduced to open intelligence, I said, oh, how can that be so simple? Short moment of complete relaxation? What do you mean? Like not doing anything about my intimate relationship, not, not uh, doing anything about not having money or being passive all the time or being jealous and not changing that, being negative and not being compassionate not being open to people, not being loving. How can I just let it, let it be as it is? Doesn't make sense to me. Because for me, in my own experience, I changed everything to positive. The positive thinking was my mission. Positive thinking, positive experiences, positive relationship, positive people, positive energy. <laughs> Where is it? Where the hell is it? Positive energy. Can you give it to me in a, in a bag? It's, but, but that's what I believed in. And with all the respect to each one of you with your belief system, that's okay. I, I just let it all be as it is. I was never forced to change my belief systems or, or what, I, what was truly dear to my heart, like positive thinking or wanting the best for everyone. It's so natural for us that we truly want to be of benefit to all. We want to benefit ourselves, we want to benefit our family, we want to benefit our friends, we want to have uh, amazing relationships with each other, we want to be loving, we want to be open. We all want that, right? Or there's something, someone who doesn't want that? It's, we all want that. So that means it's all natural for us. If we all want that, then we agree. There is no discussions. It's we are completely at ease with allowing that to be seen and be obvious more and more in our own experience. And now how do we make it obvious? We let all the data streams be as they are. All the thoughts and emotions again, all the negativity, the excessive negativity, things that we think unbearable to think of, to feel, to allow ourselves to feel that. Because it's the only way to connect. It's the only way to truly understand what's going on for one another. If we allow ourselves to feel that, we allow others to feel the same. And in allowing everything to be as it is, we naturally take responsibility for our actions, for our activities, for our speech, for our mind. We just know that we don't want to harm anyone else. We know that all these data streams, whatever they are, they are open intelligence, they are pure goodness. There is nothing to do about them. There is nothing to do about anger or jealousy or desire. So that's the magic of reality. That's the true magic of reality. Like everything is perfect in nature. Like sky is unaffected, that's our mind, unaffected. Now we cannot really make it unaffected. It's all it is. It's without any effort. So how do we train that up? Short moments of open intelligence. Coming here, listening to the experience of others who, who, who share, we share our own experience of how it is for us to live a life of benefit, to rely on open intelligence, to train up in the empowerment network of the balanced view, you know, the short moments, the, the training, the, the, the written text that every single word evoke that power of open intelligence. When you read, you just know that. And then the community and the trainers who share the experience. And it's, it's just a, a, a very simple shift, yet very profound. Very profound. Like, I can't still believe how simple it is. How simple it is. So to be generously given this support, I just... My heartfelt suggestion will be just take it. No. Don't ignore that. Because it, it, is, uh, it will change your life completely. It changed my life completely. You know, from, from, from taking myself to be a victim of my thoughts and emotions to not be a victim anymore. <clears throat> and to feel empowered and exalted and, and 
finally having a choice of how I want to live my life, how I want to deal with my thoughts and emotions. Uh, what kind of direct changes can I make in my life for the benefit of all? Now, the benefit of all can sound a bit, you know, big. But even if it means for you the benefit of yourself, the benefit of your family, the, the benefit of people who are dear to you, who you love so much, start there, you know, start there. Because it, it will naturally just expand, expand inexhaustibly for the benefit of all you see that you cannot really locate your love to one person or locate benefit to two people or a group or just your family. In relying on open intelligence, you expand the power to be of benefit to all. Everywhere you go, everyone is attracted to you, to your abilities, to your power, to your speech, to your mind, because um, you're just so natural so natural about everything, so natural to feel social awkwardness or, or anger or, or desire or shyness, embarrassment, you know, all of the things that we took to be so, um, like, we were so afraid to feel, I know for myself, I was so afraid to feel negative or angry or jealous, you know, now it comes up, allowing, I'm allowing that to be as it is, and I'm taking responsibility for my data swims. So if I wouldn't allow that to be as it is, that would just, my, my, my life would be just so funny, so like pointless in that way. You know, just acting on every single emotions I'm, I'm feeling or what I'm thinking, what I want to say to people because I'm honest and I want to say to you what I'm feeling now. That would be just so limited. But in allowing the data stream be as it is, we truly see what will benefit everyone. Our speech is fueled with open intelligence. With that intelligence, which is um, beneficial, naturally beneficial. So we tap into that intelligence again and again. You know, we make that obvious. We are not making obvious the reification. Reification means making something into, believing that something has independent nature replacing our thoughts and emotions to be positive, avoiding our thoughts and feelings, indulging in everything, indulging in stories, blaming, criticizing, gossiping. All these actions are resolved by the power of open intelligence, like completely gone. Can you imagine? For many of us, it's just completely gone. All over the world, people rely on open intelligence, so these actions are not happening anymore gossiping, criticizing, harmful actions, harmful speech. So everything is beneficial in an uncontrived way. And that's what you feel here. That's the power of the community, demonstrating that. When, you, when you're here, you see it's not something to, to be faked. The smile, the love, the openness, the warm-hearted invitation here is, is, is pure, believe it or not. It's, it's just like that, very intimate. Why? Because we, we, we know for ourselves how everything feels like. And we all take responsibility and that's why everyone is welcome because it's our passion, that's our dedication, dedication to benefit all. The commitment to let everyone know about that. Everyone should know about the right to the nature of mind. 